Hello castaways, welcome back to my playthrough of Stranded Deep, Wellington 6012 here. Right, uh, we'll get straight into it. On the cards for today is... I uh, just need to sort out some stuff actually. Um, my inventory, so quite a few things. Just uh, oh, best, best we grab a drink. So we'll do that. Uh, yeah, so no room. <sighs> Alright, we'll sort this out. Uh, yeah, so I've been, I've just come back into it now, I, after the last episode went for about another 20-30 minutes, uh, got rid of all the trees on that island, apart from those two ficus trees that you cannot cut down, uh, paddled back here, and just as, landed on the sand just as the sun came up, so we are a, a new day, uh, yes. So, let us have a little bit of a quick look at what... Uh, I managed to get over at the island and then we will sort out what we're going to do with it so there's my knife I need to grab that back uh, that's cool sticks rations we will put them in the rations container more sticks we'll sort all that out while we're here and there's my axe that one will stack somewhere. And there's sticks and stones. Right. So, yeah, we need to start thinking about motors for... Okay, mental note, we have enough blue things. Uh, duct tape. Yeah, we need to start thinking about motors for fuel. Motors for fuel? That makes no sense. I need to start thinking about potatoes, growing some potatoes to make fuel. So in order to do that, we need to do some gardening. In order to do gardening, we really need one of the uh, clay water bottles, which is... where is it? It's in there somewhere. Oh, hey, there's a new tool belt there. Hmm. Not that I'm really using my tool belt. Uh, maybe it's consumables. Yeah, a water skin, uh, which yeah, we can pretty much do now. Oh, seven days. Okay, um, no, we can probably do that now. Tanning rack. Right. Uh, I think we actually had the parts for that over here somewhere. Because we did have some leather and a stick. Right. Um, so... The building is probably going to go in here somewhere. So I guess a tanning rack. Well, here's a good a spot as any. Uh, oh, no, that's making a water skin, not a tanning rack. How do I make a tanning rack? Um, loom. Tanning rack. Four sticks, four lines. Okay. Uh, one, one, two, three, four. And I'll get some lines from over here. Ah, okay. So, uh, yeah, we need to organise that. I'll need to get some clay. Do I need clay? No, I don't need clay. Hang on. That's not the... I don't want a water skin. I want a water bottle. Water skin. Water bottle. Yeah, that's what I want to do. So I need a furnace, some line. Okay. Well, no, I'll, I'll start off with a water skin, and we can build up to um, we can build up to that. Uh, right. We'll just put all this stuff in here. Uh, leather. We need to, but we will. Whoops. On to those, and we needed some line. I'll love it. Oh, we're going to have to make some more. Alright, so we'll sort out this water. So, uh, one, two, three, four for the line. And four for the still. Which kind of looks like it's full already, but it's not. Alright, so how are we off? 
we're still not too bright in the sun, so it's all good. So yeah, a pretty good haul from that island. Um, yeah, I really need to, I think, we'll just pop that there. And now we can make a water bottle. Cool. Awesome. Uh, yeah, so we'll need to start thinking also about a boat. So that's also maybe a task for today if I get time. Because um, we'll, we'll use the barrels, which uh, there's, well, there's one there. There are some in the hold of the cargo ship. And then, were there any over here on this boat? I can't remember. Hang on. Um, and something that I've just realised is that I do have a custom island which is a graveyard island, which will be just out there. So that's actually not too far away. So if we need more resources, we can head out there um, for containers and stuff. But we're pretty good at the moment. And, no, nah, it's boys on the back of there. Uh, I don't know what it is. I just prefer to make my boats out of um, out of the 44-gallon uh, drums. So, yeah. Hmm. Right, um, yeah, so probably our next island that we'll be going to will probably be back to the start island, because we've already got water and stuff there. I'll swing by there and dismantle the plank making thing, and yeah, then we'll go over over there, so that's sort of a plan, so yeah. Um, so we'll start off with a garden and get into, into doing that. So in order to do that. I need to farming. There we go. In order to make yeah, I can make that, but I need a hoe. Okay. Um. Yeah. So that's uh, a graveyard out there, and just speaking of custom islands. This island here, I am going to publish, and I was just getting the files together to do that, and line a stick in a, one of those, okay, and yeah, I need to come up with a name for it, so I've come up with a name that means Sanctuary in Tereo Māori Tereo Māori, pronounce it right uh, so this is oh, let's see if I can get this right Faka Maru no hang on just let me pause for a second and I'll see if I can pronounce it right, hang on okay, Faka Maru Tonga that's, uh, that's the name of it, known uh, yeah, that's that's just a, a dictionary translation to Century. So Century Island, Fakamaru Tonga. And I'll get better at pronouncing that as time goes on, hopefully. Um, hmm. So yeah, that's that's what I'm gonna call it. Uh, I need a stone, don't I? Get this plow happening. Plow ho. Crude ho. There we go. Okay. Right, uh, just put those rations, rations, I'm sure there's a rations box here somewhere. Ration spears, cloth, hammers, leather, flare guns, emergency rations. And air tanks as well. Okay, uh, how are we off for food? Okay, we might need to actually, just while we're here, while it's still light and while it's still relatively hot, Hot. I might just go for a quick swim. See if we can't get some fishies. And then we'll get into building a garden. Farming some potatoes. And I'll need to do extra water things. Extra water stills. So the cod tend to be a little bit deep. I prefer to try and get some cod because... They're a medium sized meat, and then you sort of don't have to worry too much about there's some down there. 
And it just, yeah, you're not spending all your time cooking. So I'll grab four of these. No, there's one there. Do just need to be careful because there is a shark spawn point just out here. <laughs> I don't know who put that there. Bought some clay. We need to grab that at some point. So yeah, it's um, quite busy just trying to do stuff and get stuff in the right order. Uh, yeah, so but that's that's all good. That's part of the game. Yep, then we're all good. So we'll just put this spear away and we'll get uh, get cooking. Awesome, didn't hurt myself that time. Which, uh, as I think I've said previously, it is pretty random whether you get hurt or not. It's nothing to do actually with how you how you do stuff. Oh, gross. It's not gross. There is nothing wrong with filleting a cod. <laughs> Okay, so, uh, what are we up to? Done a hoe. Okay. Need to put some more fuel in that. Okay, so that's, uh, that's all good. Right. Right, right, right. Let's us... Oh, and just stacking stuff. I had a bit of a Google of that. It is a new feature. And the, it's only right really recent in the past week or two, I think. And it's only just um, certain things that the developers have done. So not iron, not planks yet. But that's okay. So what I might do is put... I don't want to do this. So... Okay, I might put the gardening thing in here. So let's go to farming. And we'll make it out of planks, which I don't have any planks. One, two, three, four. Okay. quite big aren't they they look bigger than I remember but maybe not so put that there now I need to what I'll do is I'll put the water on the end here so then she might I might put another couple in I might do that move these a little bit okay and I'll put another one down here or should I no no I won't <laughs> I'll put one down the seat. Awesome. Okay. And then what I'll do is need to water it. Not drink the water. Okay. Need to make some water thingies. So we really need like a few of those so we can keep up with, with the water. There's a new tool belt there as well. Hmm. Uh, that one. Okay, so we need a coconut thingy. Line, rocks, and stuff. Okay. Uh, what I might 
might do actually is I'll take that over here and I'll start to put oh, I grabbed the wrong one that one and I'll start to put this iron in here actually just to keep it a little bit tidier since I can't do piles of it So I'm going to use the iron for the walls on my building. Right, so that's that sorted. Uh, okay, we're going to have to... Too many things to do. <laughs> uh, we'll drop that. Chop it all up. Because so I think I can make piles of fronds, so that will be quite useful. Cool. What I want to do is go make some line and I'll make a hook to put the. Oh, really? Uh, we'll just. We'll drop. We'll drop you for a second. Okay. So I'll make a pile of those there. Nice pile. Uh, we'll keep those couple in our inventory. Right. No view. Empty. Um, can we actually, since we can make these now, can we break them down? Seem to be able to. Oh, yes. Okay, so we get a bit of... Oh, it's some lashing. That's, uh, that's useful. So, what I will do is... I think I've got... Oh, I need some sticks. Make a hook. Which is... There. And we'll put it... We'll just put it down the end here. Then one of these containers had a light in it. That one. There we go. Cool. Right. Are we off for uh, food? Okay, dinner must be just about ready. And we'll just... So you just can't really hold a lot in these things. I oh, will grab a drink. Oh gosh, it's all go. It's all go. As I say, this hard mode really does make it quite interesting to sort of um, keep up to speed with everything. So, okay, I need to make a line. Okay, I'm going to have to make another line, actually. Uh, I need some stones. Need some cloth. There was some in the container over there. And, okay, I'm going to need another whole lot of line. Right, we're going to have to go line hunting. Uh, okay, so... One. 
Hmm. Okay. Um, can't see. <laughs> Alright. Oh, there's a yucca in there. I can definitely see a yucca. Where is it? There it is. Actually, I might just break up one of those other boxes because I've got a whole stack of them there. One, two... Three, four... Oh, that's, that's enough for a... Uh, it's enough for another line, so we'll grab that. Grab some coconuts. Must be one up in a tree here somewhere. There's, there's one. There's another coconut. There's one. Right, so two of those, okay, and we need some wine, so we'll just break down a couple of these. Why can't I break you? Can't destroy with items inside. What are inside? There's nothing inside that. Bizarre. Okay, so now we've got two lashings. So we just need two cloths, and that was a good guess at which um container it was in. Rocks. Need three rocks. Mm. A lot of rocks in one of these containers. Okay, after getting it first time last time, it's going to be the last container. Absolutely typical Murphy's Law. Right, so. One. Two. Okay, so I'll grab stuff out of here. Grab those as well. If that's um, up in there. Alright, so we'll break these down. Quite an efficient way to bring those back to the island is just a whole lot at once. thing. Hopefully I've uh, managed to recover everything. Yep. Still seems intact. again. Now the thing's not in the way. There we go. Alright, so next trick is going to be to go and find some uh, potatoes. To plant. To plant and multiply. Thing is, I do have a bit of an idea of where there are some. 
I mean, I know I edited this and created this island, but uh, even so, I don't exactly know where I put stuff. But from memory of exploring the island, I do have a little bit of an idea where there might be some. Okay, so 50 is the maximum that you can put in a pile. So we will do another pile. All right, uh, well, I've got so many stones. Because I already got them out. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, it's just uh, we got four. Okay, we could probably do with a drink. Where's my axe? Hmm. Okay. Give me a torch. Bats. Ugh. I did actually eat a bat. I caught a bat over on the other island. And yeah, had, a, had it for dinner. Uh, it wasn't really worth the hassle. I thought bats were medium sort of size. There's a potato. Uh, but no, it was just a small meat, so we'll grab you. So those two, or one, but there's another potato over here. I remember seeing it up in, there it is. Any more around here? They are sort of kind of hidden away. But uh, I think two is going to have to do for now. So if we grow them, then we can use those to plant out the other one. Seems like a plan, especially when water is a bit of a hassle at the moment. Oh, there's my axe. Uh, hold F to water. should be enough for them to be going on with and I'll just drop that there so that, that is ready for us next time all right just need to fill these up again uh, I can probably leave the hoe here as well We are making progress. We are indeed. Okay, so that's all cool. Um, yeah, awesome. Right, what are we going to do now? Because they're just going to do their thing. Uh, I might just, yeah, I might start off putting in my base of operations. So, just uh, sticks, planks. Oh, have I got a hammer? No, I've got a hammer. Right, we need to make sure we leave room for a hammer. And we'll get you over here. I don't know what's in that one. Because that was the one I couldn't bash. Okay. Go grab a hammer. 
and I'll make a bit of a start on this. Oh. Need a drink? I'll grab a drink while we're here. Okay, so this is, well, it's kind of, kind of a high point here. Now, this island design, I've kind of sort of shot myself in the foot, really. Uh, what I mean by that is, what I normally like to do with my bases is build them, like, uh, on the water, almost, so that boats I can bring up and moor, and then when I'm transferring stuff, I don't have to run so far. Uh... It's not really suitable over there. It's not suitable here because I've got the sandbar, which I don't know why I included that. And there's also a wreck there and stuff, so I can't actually get my boats in here. Um, bearing in mind that when they get a bit bigger, they're not too manoeuvrable. Over this side, I've got this nice channel, but again, it's the same sort of problem. That I can't actually navigate boats in. The Especially this bit. Even though it looks okay, it looks deep, which it is. It's reasonably deep. There's actually some rocks just out, out in there. So last episode, when I started paddling out here, and I got to this point and said, right, I'm going to edit and skip through. And then I said, yep. And then it faded to black. When I got to about here, I got hung up on a rock. <laughs> and I got stuck on there for a minute or two. So it was a good thing I already said that I was going to edit it because uh, you didn't notice. But yeah, it's um, yeah, there's rocks out there <laughs> which the boats get caught on. Uh, yes, but anyway, let's just uh, fill this up, just more so to get stuff out of my inventory. Cool, cool. Uh, yeah, so I'm just going to start building, hmm, so I can sort of figure out where stuff's going. So, uh, we need to grab our hammer. And then we can start with a floor like that. So that's pretty much the same sort of angle as that. And this, I reckon, is the high point. So maybe about there. Now, I'm not going to finish it. I'm just going to use it to set it out. Because really what I want to do is get close. Wait, why won't you... Oh. Yeah, I kind of want to build over here. And I'll probably knock these down. Um, so I'm going to use planks around the edge of it. And then I'll use clay floor for the inside. I think that will work quite well. So that's fine. Now we'll start moving this way. I keep pressing the wrong button. Okay, so if we if we put another foundation, okay, I haven't got enough things. Grab some more. Okay, so if I put that here, is that too close? Because then I would put... Uh, why do I keep pressing the wrong button? I'll put in a pair of stairs. Like... Come on, you can do it. You, oh, there we go. No, I, I don't think that's too close. So we'll lock that in. Then finish this one off. Uh, finish this one off. 
And then where I'm standing, there'll be another couple. Yeah. I think that'll work. So it'll be too wide, this sort of veranda. And if we... Two... do that one just yet okay um yeah one two three okay maybe it'll just be a veranda along there that will be one wide and we can have a bit more of a platform out here yeah okay so there'll be more more platforms along here yeah okay uh let me do that and I'll be back in a minute, or three, or six. Alright, so the sun looks like it's just coming up again, so... Must be breakfast time. Let us uh, head through here. So that's pretty much going to be me sort of for the day, I think, for this episode. Let's grab a drink, and... Oh, fire's gone out. Hopefully that's cooked. It is cooked. Alright, so we're looking pretty good there. We put our torch away since um, since it's no longer night time. Now I'll just grab some sticks. So yeah, I'll finish this off, but I'll just, before we go, I'll really quickly show you what I want to do here. We'll just get rid of you, and yeah, so I'm just going to put half wall. A half wall along there. A half wall along there. And a half wall along there. So I'll just put this up. Alright, so this will be the veranda. And I'll put some roof over that. It'll be a corrugated iron wall here. And another one here. And this will be uh, clay floors, because then I can put like fires and stuff on there as well. So uh, yeah, that's um, that's all coming together quite well. Do I need to give them order? No, they're fine. I just generally try and keep these about three quarters full, because if I get a storm come through and then it rains, then that will top it up. So it just means I can sort of stay on top of this. Uh, yeah, but they are all good. So. I'll just Grab seven of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Pop them on there. One, two, three. So we're all. Whoops. Didn't intend to drink that. Uh, yes. So that's um that's a start. And sort of more to the point, I think I've got some things laid out and possibly in my own mind how I'm going to sort of do it. So I've got the four potatoes there. Sort of four I find enough to keep up with um, fuel. Because you're going to put sort of four in the thing at a time anyway. Uh, and I'll probably put my fuel making facilities here maybe. Yeah. Um, and then I might put some yucca plants in here. And that way that'll keep me um, up to speed with with uh, these I mean it's fine now I've just got the the fronds that I can use so yeah that's um that's all coming together and we'll build um this platform will probably continue out here or maybe out this way um once I figure it out and that'll be my landing pad for my gyrocopter so lots of uh lots of things to do really um yeah but that's that's enough for this episode what I might do is I'll continue on for a little bit and maybe put a few more walls in and do a bit of building because it's just, yeah, it takes forever. Um, but yeah, so hopefully you can join me again next time 
and we'll get up to something else. Probably start grabbing those drums and pulling them out and making a bit of a uh, boat barge type thing to head back to the start island over there before we start to explore some other things. Hmm. So yeah, thanks everybody for watching. We'll hopefully see you again next time. Stay safe out there and have a good one.